Hi friends, let's make a mail icon. So here we are in Figma and today we're going to be making sure that our nudge settings are set correctly. I'm going to press Command P or Control P on Windows and I'm going to type in nudge amount. I'm going to set my small nudge to 0.5. Next, we're going to draw a rectangle. Press the R key and draw out a rectangle. What we want this to do with the icon grid is to be two from that main point right there. Let's extend this all the way to the edge. Now we're going to press Shift X to swap the fill in the stroke. Let's set that stroke color to be black. We are also going to make sure that that stroke is set to the center. And now we're going to double click here. And when we double click, we want to move the point with our keyboard. And because our small nudge is set to 0.5, it's going to move it in half pixel increments. I want to make sure that those two pixels are from the first red line there. And I want it to match on the bottom that there's those two lines right there. Next, we're going to select that point, the top left point point and then press the P key. That's going to pull out the pen tool. And then we're going to find this intersection of these guides right here. We're going to click there and then we're going to go back up to the top right and connect it. Next, we're going to select the bottom left point and bring it up top here. So we don't want to go to the midpoint of that line, but instead we're looking for the nice 45 degree angle. You will feel it snap as you create it. So you'll see it hovered on that that line. So let's go ahead and click that point. Next, let's do the same thing here. I'm going to move it up and then we're going to click that point. Now, all we have left to do is to select this, go to the advanced stroke options, and we're going to select a rounded corner join. And that's going to be all for today. So hopefully you found that helpful. Feel free to leave any questions you have in the comments. And as always, happy designing.